Okay, with me here is Alva. Alva Stewart. Alva, first treatment here, okay. Yeah. And you heard me in the radio show for a long time. What made you finally decided to come? Oh, um, I didn't think I could uh, get my own doctor. I didn't think my insurance would pay. I thought they'd, I'd, I'd be stuck with whatever doctor they give me. And um, what was the problem? What What is the the thing that symptom that make you? Come well, I was healthy you. my whole life, and uh, back in May of this year, I had a heart attack because I. Uh, I was running down for a while and I wasn't eating right, you know, I was just working all day and I, and I was in the shower and I, I panicked because I didn't think I could stand up during, you know, to, and I realized, you know, I better get to the hospital. My, my, my neighbor looked at me and said, hey, you know, I want to bring you to the hospital I, and I refused a couple of times and then I realized, you know, I better go. And when I went, I uh, they told me that uh, that I had had a heart attack, and I you know I knew something was wrong. And uh, they tell me that as a result of that heart attack, my kidneys uh, were, were failed, and they won't you know. They put you on dialysis. They put me on immediately. I mean, they put a they had a catheter in me before I knew <laughs> what was going on. So I was very distrusting of that, just because it seemed to me that um, that's the objective is to get me into dialysis. You know, it is okay. So what is the symptom? What what was the symptom that bothered you all this time? Oh, the worst thing is I couldn't breathe. You know, and and mm -hmm. that and I went into the hospital again three more subsequent times because after being released and I was So in, you told them that you cannot be couldn't They breathe. didn't do anything about it. The only thing that relieved that was I went to a different hospital and they shot me up with uh, morphine and then I could breathe. So I so I knew it had but to be like this. No, yeah, not right. no, no, I uh, mm -hmm. this is the first time since it, my heart attack that I don't notice that I you know, I mean, I, I struggle to breathe. I, I can't get over the threshold of breath necessary to, um, and I've had to change my breathing patterns to a faster interval so I, I don't fall behind in my breath. Then I have to catch up and, and hyperventilate. And so, I mean, you feel well, you have a, a lump in your throat because you don't talk like this. I've been yeah. telling every doctor that I got this, it feels like I got a ping pong ball stuck wedged in my throat. And they don't say anything. Their typical response is no response. They don't have anything to say about that. Because they don't know why that happened. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, that's just the worst thing because it interferes with all day I'm burping. It feels like I have the trapped air and I'm just burping and burping and burping. Kind of scary, and, isn't it? it? It interferes with my eating, you know? I, mm -hmm. I, I, um, I mean, you know, you I get hungry. <laughs> I get hungry about once a day, and that's about it. And, uh, and you couldn't talk either, because before the treatment, you couldn't talk either. Not like this. It's a little hard to talk when you're burping, I'm saying. Mm -hmm. you know. But anyway, uh, okay. No, I feel relatively uh, normal right now. I yeah, mean, you're sitting down, you're sitting down, you know, not standing up, but yeah. But standing up, you were still okay outside? Well, um, I, when I stand up, I, I, I have this, like, a, like a... Uh, I get chill to my whole body when yeah. I'm standing up. But aside from that, okay, your breathing problem is a lot better. Yeah, I don't notice uh, I'm not struggling. To, and the uh, lump in the throat. That's gone. Yeah. <laughs> For the first time. Uh, this is the first yeah. treatment. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we will continue follow you up and see how you do every time. And I can tell you, eventually you will uh, breathe, right, you'll continue to breathe like this. But we hope to get you out of dialysis. Yeah, okay? Great. Okay. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, man. Mm -hmm.